This video is about our pastors, elders, and bishops all the same office. Hi, I'm Bake Adafi and this is Bible Study. This video is about our pastors, elders, and bishops all the same office. Hi, I'm Bake Adafi and this is Bible Study verse by verse. If you'd open your Bible to the New Testament, to the book of 1 Peter, chapter 5, we'll begin in just a moment. Now, 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 1 and 2, our pastors and elders and bishops are those names the same office. Elder, pastor, bishops. I think they're the same office and I think I can prove it to you. Verse 1 and 2 here says, The elders which are among you I exhort. And then he gives us qualifications. He's an elder. He's witnessed the sufferings of Christ. He's partaken of the glory. Then he says in verse 2, Feed the flock, that's pastoring, of God which is among you, taking the oversight thereof, that's being a bishop. So elders, pastors, bishops, synonymous terms. They're used synonymously in the New Testament. They're descriptions of the same person fulfilling the same office, uh, each with a different kind of function, but uh, wrapped up in, in one person. The qualifications for the office are given in 1 Timothy 3, verse 1 through 7, where the name of bishop is used, and the ability to teach or to pastor is set forth. Then in Titus chapter 1, verse 5 through 9, the same qualifications are set forth. And the job there is called elder and bishop. And, and that person has the ability to teach or to pastor. Paul calls the elders from Ephesus to him and tells them to oversee, that's bishop, and to feed, that's pastor, the church at Ephesus. Acts 20, verse 17 and 28 says, And from Miletus he sent to Ephesus and called the elders of the church, and then verse 28, Take heed therefore to yourselves and all the flock which the Holy Ghost has made you overseers to feed the church of God which he has purchased with his own blood. This is the way the scripture looks at this office. All three of those things, all three of those nouns represent the same person doing the same job. Now, those jobs are a little different, overseeing and watching out for the welfare. Well, let's talk about that. Elders, older men, they have experience. They, they are an example for us to follow. They're blameless. They have a good reputation, according to uh, 1 Timothy and Titus. And then they're overseers. That's in our verse 2. They watch. They oversee. They're diligent to look at the church and direct it, to give it, uh, preserve it from heresies and from false teachers, and to make sure that the people in the church are being fed God's word and are prospering in the word of God. And uh, as pastors, they're supposed to be extremely able to teach God's word, to handle the word of God, to teach and preach and counsel with it. Lastly, notice about elders and bishops and pastors, that there's supposed to be a plurality of them in a church. Peter writes to the elders which are among you in that church. Titus ordains elders. Paul called the elders of the church. All plural ideas. Pastoring is not supposed to be a one-man show. So, pastor, elder, bishop, all the same person, different functions of that job that that person has to do. And the New Testament makes it very plain that these three are the same office. Thanks for watching. I hope the Lord saves you as you commit yourself in faith to the Lord Jesus Christ. I have hundreds of Bible teaching videos on my YouTube channel. You can click the red circle icon below to go there. Then you can click on the playlist and select the videos you'd like to watch. If you have questions or comments about this video, you can email me at all one word, Bible study 